thank you. Uh, I hope Nidhi uh, Mishu uh, is last of the northern east uh, in the agenda uh, of cooperation and river uh, 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 After two days, with uh, very rich, very technical and very valuable presentation, I think you deserve to have a break on these new issues. I will not uh, bother you with another presentation, but I would like to uh, share uh, with you some challenges that facing media and how it can be enabled to play active role in supporting informed decision making and public awareness on water and energy investment in a little nine days. Challenges of changing media system. We have to admit that we live in an era where media system is changing dramatically. To the extent that the old tradition uh, we have uh, admit, uh, we have to admit that we live in an era where media system is changing dramatically. To the extent that the old traditional uh, paradigm about the role of media established for decades as a tool for building public opinion has never been telling us today. Ironically, the role of media for shaping public opinion has been questionable while living in a society where practices of democracy and freedom of press are established and deeply rooted. I guess the recent USA presidential election caused the attention of all of you, as well as different people around the globe. One of the special consequences of this election, the showdown between the then Republican presidential nominee, later President-elect Donald Trump, and the media, in unprecedented confrontation, to the extent that voices arise warning from the plain who face appealing to protect media. Has USA election a few weeks ago been a turning point for the influences or the influence of news media? Did media ruin election uh, in the United States of America? This is tiny uh, questions ignite wide debate about the future of the media role in shaping public opinion, even attitudes, perception, preferences, persuasion, and propaganda. No doubt that media has failed in its, uh, its established role for a long time as a determinant factor in shaping public opinion. Simply, people prove they can make their decision independently, independently against the choice of media and its will. Last week, renowned CNN, Christian Amandur gave a speech on the challenges that journalists face in Trump era, says, I never in a billion years so I will be up here on stage appealing for the freedom and safety of American journalists at home. Is that an exaggeration? Can American media deny it was biased? Media bias challenge. Even since media has existed, so has media bias. The two go hand in hand. Countless political cartoons and infographics have been made on the subject, warning readers of the danger of getting their information from only a single platform or not validating sources. The problem is that faces media users today isn't that they don't realize media bias exists, it's that they don't know that they can control pre to it. What relevance to our issue we are discussing today? The reason learned, no one can take people for granted. I, that is to say, people's voices cannot be manipulated. Regardless of the details of this very interesting development, it is very obvious that it is not an easy task at all to raise the media role issue without being trapped into controversy. 
It appeared much of the media got itself into a knot trying to differentiate between balance, objectivity, neutrality, and crucially, truth. Challenge of news versus views. According to professional journalistic norms, news and views must be separated. But in actual practice, the borderline may not always be clear. And in the minds of some audience, it may not even be desirable. Challenging news paradigm. Our understanding of press, for obvious reasons, is to a large degree based on the fact that they report on the news. However, there are limits to the informational news paradigm. If we are to understand the political and social role of media, for example, news are also written, published, and read because they carry political viewpoints and arguments, and in a wider sense, interpretations of the social and cultural world. So, the issue of media role is not just about reporting facts, positively and constructively, but really more important than that. Its ability in changing set of minds of people in the region towards a new concept of cooperation agenda. The task is much bigger than only ensuring empires reporting. But how to make paradigm shift to change what has been dividing on line of national interests for tens of centuries? To construct a new path for public belief and social change to promote regional interest and to give cooperation up a hand because it's an inevitable path for the benefit of all night facing citizens and to convince people that we have a common future. We need the media to promote the exchange and disseminate the academic knowledge and to guard bridges between research, policy decision making, processes, and public. How to promote in depth and critical research in which to generate greater understanding of rapidly changing dynamics of water and non water issues <coughs> regarding the key role of the land, water, energy, nexus. Way forward, how to ensure new role for media? We shouldn't take media role for granted, or just as a mirror to reflect technical facts and findings. In our case of development issues and necessity of promoting cooperation agenda, media have been forgotten for long and have not brought on board from early beginning of the nine building agenda. Thanks to Sweden and uh, Enter for a very uh, interesting uh, workshop. Uh, I and a number of my colleagues from Egypt and Ethiopia and South Sudan, uh, we held in uh, Ethiopia last July. It was very uh, educative and informative. Some of my, I see some of my colleagues here from Egypt and uh, uh, Ethiopia. Let me to a great example. I think this is a chance to hear their voices uh, in this workshop. Many have been forgotten for a long and have time and have brought uh, on board for an early beginning of the Nile painting agenda. Although of efforts being exerted, but communication with media must be far beyond protein relationship. From forward looking point of view, there is an urgent need to design a multidisciplinary research with wide scope to give the media a different perspective of my cooperation from the point of views of political, social, economic, cultural, public stakeholders. To help in building a new deal for media aware with the dynamics behind information sharing that assist in orientation of a new role for media and to define ways and means of different approaches, not just to inform people, but more importantly, to encourage them to play active role in supporting and, talk and, and taking key part in implementing development programs and projects. And to enhance awareness about 
now in present uh, issues as well as with the case for my cooperation based on political review of role played by media so far. So there is desperate need to formulate an interdisciplinary political, socioeconomic, cultural, informational strategy. Thank you. 